You like the best of both worlds? What's that? Guys and girls. I do. I definitely dabble in both worlds and I love it. I love a sexy man, I love a sexy woman. And do you like anal sex? I don't like it, I love it. Yes! But I would definitely rather get DP than do straight anal you know, any day of the week. You all, like holes, all holes filled is my favorite. So you like airtight. Okay, what's the most you ever took on at a time? 50. <laughs> 50? <laughs> oh wow, how long I'm I can a bad girl, how long I know. that took to shoot. Uh let's see. I got there around 1 p.m. Got out of makeup around 2. We left, completed shooting around 10 p.m. that night, so. Wow, 10 p.m.? Yeah. I thought you were going to tell me the next morning, but I guess right. when you're no, dealing with it didn't take professionals as long as most that know what think. they're doing. Yeah, for the most part. <laughs> you ever have fake producers hit you up? Fake producers? Yeah, a lot of people. A lot of fakes out there. And how do you filter out hmm, who's credible and who's full of shit? Uh, you just gotta ask for references. And whoever I know out of that reference list, I will contact them and say, hey, is this guy real, fake? And if they don't, you know, match up, then... So basically word of mouth and just talking to your peers and does this level up? Absolutely, yeah. And has guys annoyed you with this one question? Uh, yeah, can I be in your next movie? Can you give me a shot? I do get that a lot. A lot, a lot. A lot of guys ask me, like, how can I get into porn? You know, and they think that the girl, like, has control over that at all. But honestly, to be a male talent, you either gotta know somebody or, you know, you gotta, uh, webcam or do something, get an agent, like, there's not much a girl can do. You just gotta find a way. I mean, you had your unique story, the people I interviewed over the years had unique stories, but asking you is not gonna get far. Right. I mean, I guess I can get, you know, a quote-unquote civilian, I hate that word, but a civilian, you know, in one of it's my... It's a big difference. <laughs> yeah. Because they think, oh, it's just drop my pants and get busy, but... It's, uh, yeah, they don't understand it how it's like, you have a crowd around you, filming, watching, you know? And um, <laughs> they tell you when to come. Like, all right, now it's time to pop, pop right now. And if they can't, they fail, then they don't get hired. Mm. So, <laughs> I, I got a lot of respect for male talent. I mean, shit. Yeah, they, they got it rough early? sometimes. What's that? Do you hate when guys come early? No, I think it's a compliment. A lot of the time, actually. Really? Like, yeah. It was that good, baby. Some women <laughs> take offense to that, but... Why? I mean, they're so turned on that they, you know, come. Obviously, the girl did that to them. I feel honored. But that's my personal opinion. And how tall are you? I'm 5'4", fun size. Uh, can you stand up for us, please? Nice boots. Thank you very much. Thank much you. to your success and I know we'll definitely be seeing you more at trade shows. Absolutely. It was great talking to you.